weird chat. Okay, we're back. That was so weird. Uh, but we are we are so back. We are so back. Uh, I am going to fix the display. Show is she sparking zero. Hold on, let me change the game. Sparking zero. Okay. All right, chat, can you guys hear the game? Are we good? Yo! Obtain Dragon Balls too? Oh, hell yeah. We are good? Okay, good, 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 good. Vegeta, we finished Goku and Vegeta's story. So now we're gonna do Gohan's story. Cool, let's get underway. I respect Gohan, he is one of my favorite characters. Gohan was determined to train like never before in the hyperbolic time chamber with his father. And all of these actions stem from the words of a mysterious young man. Three years ago, when Gohan and the others had safely returned to Earth, Frieza, who survived the last battle on planet Namek, descended to Earth with his army. Gohan and friends detected Frieza's key and arrived immediately, but they found not just Frieza, but a mysterious young man as well. The boy transformed into a Super Saiyan and annihilated the entire Frieza force instantly. Not only that, but he also predicted the place and time when Goku would return to Earth. When Goku arrived as foretold, he gave him a message then left. His message was that androids would appear and then attack the Earth in three years time. And sure enough, the androids appeared and began to attack humans. To make matters worse, Goku collapsed from a heart virus during the ensuing battle. As even more and the an new androids awakened, the situation changed rapidly, and several days passed before Goku finally regained consciousness. At Goku's suggestion, he and Gohan decided to train in the hyperbolic time chamber. Wow, it's so bright in here, and my body feels heavy. It's kind of hard to breathe. Yep, and not only that, but once this door is closed, we're completely cut off from contact with the outside world. Go take a look out back. That's the training area. Oh, this is crazy. How could this be inside a room? It's bigger than the whole lookout. It's just a huge, empty space. And it goes on and on like this in every direction. Try not to wander off too far, okay? You might not be able to find your way back. Yeah, right. And we, we've got to stay a year, huh? Come on. We've got to get to work right away. First off, we should get started on turning you into a Super Saiyan. A Super Saiyan? Me? I don't know. I mean, do you really think I can? Well, sure, why not? I can do it, and you're my son, aren't you? We'll spend some time teaching you how to transform, and then we'll be able to get into the real training. <laughs> Told you. It's pretty intense, right? Gravity training takes some getting used to if you've never done it before. Just keep at it, your body will adjust. Okay, Dad! I gotta win this! What? Share your energy with me!
Do I miss? Oh, I miss. This way, he's gonna turn on even stronger than I hoped. Shit. 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 I live? Go on. You can do this. Just got to believe in yourself. Hell yeah. We did it. We just had to survive. I feel so good about that. I was like, damn, I got to beat my dad? While Goku and Gohan continue their training, Cell absorbs the other androids, reaching new heights of power. When they finish training and hit the or exit the hyperbolic time chamber, Gohan and Goku are told of a martial arts tournament, the Cell Games, to be held in nine days. The day of the Cell Games soon arrives and warriors gather around to challenge Cell in his perfect form. The first person to volunteer to fight is Goku. Vegeta and the others are standing in awe of the key generated by Goku and Cell. But as he looks on, Gohan notices that he alone has a different understanding of what's happening. Suddenly, Goku puts a halt to the battle. To the surprise of everyone, he announces his surrender. Yet, that is not only the shocking thing he says. Time for you to take over, Gohan. M me take him on? I don't... What the? Hold on. It, like, disconnected for some reason. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is madness. I'll admit, oh, hey, Gohan's abilities are far beyond what they used to be. But you're pitting him against a foe even you couldn't beat. Listen, you have to trust me. Gohan has a power within him that's greater than anything you could possibly imagine. So what do you think? You see me hit Cell with anything you couldn't handle? Have you seen me go at him with anything you don't have? Well, no, I don't think so. But you were both holding back, right? I'm sure it'd be a lot different if you were going all out. Now, I don't know about Cell, but I was giving it everything I had. You thought I was holding back because you were gauging my energy against your own. <laughs> Gohan, answer me. Is this true? Yeah. All right, Gohan. This is it. I need you to go out there and win this one for us, okay? Then we can all go home. Okay, Dad. I'll do it. Senko, my goat. That's all you do? Oh shit. I missed? I'm so sad. Senko, my goat. Why are we fighting? There's no point. We 
can just stop. Look, Gohan is so right, man. End this without violence. We really don't want to kill you. Even if you are evil, you can still walk away. I'm not interested in fighting you just for the challenge. My dad's the one who cares about that stuff. For as long as I can remember, whenever I got real mad, things would happen around me that I couldn't explain. Crazy things. What is going on? What the? Okay, I guess that works. We just had to survive. Uh, a fascinating story, but unwise to tell. If you intend to intimidate Runt, it helps to know a bit about your audience first. Gohan said all of this in Cell does not care. Let's just say for the sake of argument, it's true. You have huge reserves of power. And let's just say I'm the sort who wants to see them firsthand. Very interesting. Thanks, Cell. He let me live, though. Pretty sick. Now interested in drawing out Gohan's true power, Cell stands or sends him flying with the with a punch. Gohan fights back, but his rage has not yet conquered his will. Cell continues to inflict pain on Gohan in an attempt to draw out his anger. However, Gohan's own pain does not generate through rage. To push him beyond his limits, Cell decides to switch his target to Goku and the others. Do not come any closer. It is highly unlikely you could survive such a blast. I am going to self-destruct and take Cell with me. Huh? <laughs> such a shame, Android 16. But then a mere bomb wouldn't have been enough to destroy me anyway. Oh, 16, looks like you joined the lengthy list of Dr. Giro's failures. <laughs> What in the world is that thing? Pay attention, little ones. Time to make them suffer. No! Gohan, listen to me. There are some foes who cannot be reasoned with. You are allowed to fight on the side of justice. Seize upon your anger. Wield it like a weapon. I understand your reluctance, but holding it in is pointless. That is sound advice. Better than I expected from an appliance. But I'd much rather tear the rage out of him. Go on. I love the animals. And everything about nature. Protect them. For me. They need you. Android 16 is such a good guy, man. It's time to can it, you worthless scrap. Thought he was about to tell Gohan he loves him. He was close to it, dude. You got what you wanted, and I'll never forgive you. So your true power has finally revealed it. Perfect. Now we can get down to business. <laughs> Why can't I do it? Okay, there you go. Gohan, I love the animals. He's so sweet and so tender. Kill, but it's cool. Don't get comfortable, boy. 
Even with luck on your side, the odds of beating me are hardly in your favor. You're wrong. Yes, that's the spirit. Too bad you're going to lose it once you witness me in all my terrifying glory. What the fuck? Oh no, I missed it. Do I miss? I think I miss. Yeah, I miss. Fuck me. Do I get him? Okay, I have to do just one more. Just one more. Alright, we win. We win. We fucking own. We absolutely destroy- what? Okay, he's good, he's good. He's good. He's fucking cooked. Get destroyed, idiot. How is this possible? How can anyone on this measly planet possess so much power? Good shit, Gohan. Gohan! What are you doing? Finish him! It's all up to you! What, do you want me to end it already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. Okay, Gohan. Ew. Am I seeing things or did he just puke up 18? You know what? Now I actually feel sorry for you. You... You... You son of a... In a few moments, I'll blow myself to bits. <laughs> I might die, but then so will all of you. This planet will explode in a burst of flame! If you lay a finger on me, boom! Bye-bye, Earth! No sense in wasting your last few seconds while you Such a sore him. loser. <laughs> he fucking sucks, dude. He's so annoying. I'm gonna blow myself up because I have nowhere else to go. I've killed us. It's all my fault. I could have finished him, but I didn't. <laughs> Yo, thank you for the follow, Garf. Welcome in. Dude. I... Goku. I know that look. Goku, no. Sorry, I've thought this over, guys. Well, any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Cell is that kind of kid. Wait, Cell is that kid that turns Goodbye. off the game console when you're, you're about to win? Thinking of he is the same Goku. guy, yeah. Goku, no! He's fucked up. You did good today, Gohan. Made me proud. Dad, what are you? Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time. His, his energy, it's gone without a trace. 
switch camera? Oh my god, you can switch camera? Oh my god. Oh, you can switch in the perspective of them. Oh, that's cool. I just found out midway through. But the fact that the victory came at the cost of Goku's life weighs heavily on Gohan's shoulders. He cannot seem to escape the shadow of regret. Just then, the ground begins to rumble. From the dust, a flash of light shoots out and pierces trunks in the chest. What appears before them is Cell, but one who has grown even more powerful than before. When Cell self-destructed, he protected his core from damage, allowing him to regenerate. It is the revived Cell who struck down Trunks in a surprise attack. The fight begins once again. No one likes having a hole in their Trunks is so funny. T trunks! <laughs> Surprised to see me. <laughs> Something amuse you? Does imminent destruction put a smile on your face? It was because of my mistake that Dad had to sacrifice himself. It's my fault you put us in that position. I'd have given anything for a chance to do it over again. Now I get one! Then let's see if you've got the power to back up your words. Luck won't be on your side this time. You won't survive this time! I am done playing games. It's time I ended this. Gotta stop this! No matter what! I already told you that's enough! You fool! Forget it! Do I get him? Do I hit him? Yes, I get him. Okay. such a bitch. Do I hit him? I miss. I think I miss. No, I got him. Hell yeah. Where's he at? Oh, I miss. There we go, good shit. Good shit, Gohan. Bro is so cooked. He's so fucking dead. Damn you! If anyone's going to defeat Cell, it's going to be me! Vegeta, get the fuck out of here. What are you even doing? It's me and go it's just me. It's me right now. Let me live. What do you mean it's all about you? Relax, Vegeta. Having lost Trunks, it is do or die for Vegeta as he controls Cell, and he pours all his power into his attacks. However, even after consecutive energy blasts from Vegeta, Cell still stands unharmed. Vegeta then collapses from Cell's counterattack just so, uh, whoa. Vegeta then collapses from Cell's counterattack. Just as Cell moves in for the kill, Gohan dives in at the last minute, costing him the use of his left arm. Victory is in sight for Cell, who gathered enough ki to annihilate the entire solar system, is about to fire his attack at Gohan and the others. Please, forgive me, Dad. Earth is doomed, and it's all my fault. Just as Gohan is about to give up, a voice reaches him from somewhere unknown. It is the voice of Goku, speaking to him from the other world. Hey, don't go giving up now! That's not the Gohan I know! Dad? Is that you? Listen to me! I promise you can beat him! You just gotta believe in yourself, Gohan! Right now, you're the strongest person in the whole universe! 
Right. <laughs> I'll put this to rest. Goodbye. Uh, no! Uh, uh, no! This can't be. I am perfection. Thanks to Gohan's victory over Cell, Earth is saved and the battle is finished. Gohan and the others suggest reviving Goku with the Dragon Balls, but that wish cannot be granted. Goku has already accepted his faith and announces that he's going to stay in the other world. Gohan and his friends have grown much from battle. As they mourn the loss of Goku, they return to their daily life on peaceful Earth. Oh, hell yeah. Hi, Fluff. My cat's right here, chat. She just says hi. Fluff will say hi to chat. She says what's up. She's being pet right now, and uh, that is the equivalent of her saying, Hey, chat, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are having a good day. Alright, Majin Buu arc time? Hold on, I gotta, like, I gotta reconnect this shit. And while I'm in here, I'm going to refill my water really quick, chat. Uh, I'm gonna refill my water. BRB for a hot second. Fluffles is a perfect baby. She is so sweet, dude. I woke up earlier from my from my slumber in the morning and like both my cats were on me and it was so sweet. Like, I love her so much. She just talks. She's just a very vocal little child. She's got so much to say. So much to do. So much to feel. Alright, Majin Buu Arc, you guys ready for the shit? Why is it not working? There we All go. Alright, time to go. Time passes following the battle with Cell, and Gohan begins attending high school in the faraway Satan City so he can study to become a scholar. Disguised as the great Saiyan, lover of justice, Gohan works hard to hide his true identity as he brings down evildoers. 
but one day his secret discover or his secret is discovered by Videl, Mr. Satan's daughter. Videl threatens to reveal Great Saiyan's true identity to the world if he doesn't participate in the next world tournament. So Gohan relents. Goku overhears the other world and announces that he will also take part in the world tournament, returning to the world of the living just for one day. Gohan is overjoyed hearing he can reunite with Goku after a long period of absence and begins training with Goten to prepare for the world tournament. As he watches Videl struggle with their match with Spopovich, Gohan trembles with rage. <laughs> I hate this. I hate this. I don't like where this I is going. This. It wasn't much, but that was still an energy blast he released. I hate when he, like, basically punches her ovaries out. It's fucking horrible. Don't be fooled. He won't it risk being disqualified. The man's intentionally holding back. Yeah, but... How? Something he's done between now and the last tournament has given the guy powers way beyond what's natural to him. But I don't know what it is. I just know something's I'm shocked up. she can have kids after that beating. Dude, it's fucked up. It's one of the worst scenes in the entire show. Like, I'm not even kidding. Yeah, like, I'm the kind of gal to give up. Just give up while you still can. You fought well! It's time to throw in the towel! <sighs> I've seen enough! That's it! Now, you answer to me! What do you think you're doing, man? Keep it together! No! Oh my god, we're not doing this, right? Am I fighting him? Please no. Attempt to stop the fight or stay calm. Chat, what do I do? Which one should I do, chat? Attempt to stop the fight, or should I stay calm? Whoever whoever tells me what to do in chat, I will I will choose your option. Stop it! Oh my god! I don't remember what's canon. I, I think he tried to stop it. Alright. No one's no one's fighting Jester. I mean you go back and choose the other option for the branching path. Oh, I see. I don't go back to branching paths, though. I kind of just one and done. I, I go, I haven't gone back to any of them just yet. Uh, because I kind of want to finish all the stories first, and then I'll go back. Alright, let's attempt to stop the fight. I think you're a big man, huh? Hey, wait! Go on! <laughs> I am taking you down. <laughs> Spobovich, this is not over. I promise you that. <laughs> This is it. <laughs> this will finish you off. He's so cool. Oh no! Folks, should I maybe get the heck out of here? <laughs> lost at world tournament <laughs> fuck shit shit everyone ran away fuck i'm so sorry guys please come back i fucked up 
When it becomes Gohan's turn to fight, he turns into Super Saiyan in the arena, but moments later, Spopovich and Yamu interfere and drain Gohan's energy, causing him to collapse. Gohan asks Supreme Kai, who is on a level even higher than King Kai, to heal him. After being healed, Gohan catches up to Goku and the others, and they continue chasing after Spopovich and Yamu. Along the way, Gohan and friends are told about Majin Buu and Wizard Bobbidi soon. They infiltrate Bobbidi's spaceship and begin battling his subordinates. Goku and Vegeta fight off in a series of onrushing enemies with ease. Next up is Gohan. Gohan, you're next. Have you been keeping up with your training regimen? Sad to say your boy's got it in his head that peacetime means he can take it easy. As things are now, I could knock him over in my sleep. <laughs> but, just as we saw with Cell, if he loses his temper and snaps again, we still may be in for a show. It can't be! Debora! For a human, you're quite skilled. You've earned a warrior's respect. That said, I'm afraid I've come here to halt your progress. <laughs> your boss must be in a real panic to send you out so early. Did we make the little guy that nervous? Pathetic. <laughs> Do you take pleasure in taunting? Or are you just stalling for time? All of you, come at me. I don't think so. It's my turn, so I'm taking you on myself. Excuse me? I don't know if I can do this one. Is he tough? To mock the is, great he, is he bad? Foolish. Die! <laughs> My turn now. I'll give you a fight. Okay, I don't know if I hit this. Okay, I did. I still have so much health to deplete. This is it. I'll give you a fight. I don't know fight. if I hit this either. We'll see. Uh, okay, I did. Okay, thank God. All right, we're fine. My turn now. You want to see my bad side? You no, please, no. Me with such Your death is going to be swift. Oh, there you are. I'll give you a fight. Okay, well, I just have to survive. Yasin, how are you? I'm in class, so I cannot hear, but I hope all is good with you. Hello! I hope you're good. Nice to see you. Also, Insomnia. Hi, what's up? How are you? Uh, welcome to the stream. We are kicking the boor's ass right now. Sabura's next strategy is to have Bobbidi manipulate Vegeta. Gohan and friends leave their duel in search of Bobbidi, but Majin Buu successfully revives by absorbing, absorbing the battle energy of Goku and Vegeta. Gohan attempts to flee the scene with Supreme Kai, but they are intercepted and ensuing the attack blows far away. Gohan takes a heavy blow causing him to lose consciousness. 
Vegeta soon arrives on the scene and takes over the fight with Majin Buu. Farewell, Bulma, Trunks, and even you, Kakarot. Vegeta self-destructs in hopes of defeating Majin Buu. However, even a self-sacrificing attack such as this does not affect Buu. When Gohan regains consciousness, he finds that in the land of the Kais... Oh, he finds he is in the land of the Kais. He has narrowly escaped the destruction at the hands of Buu thanks to the Supreme Kai. In order to defeat Buu, Gohan heroically pulls out the Z-Sword, which is said to have great power to the one who wields it. Goku, who is about to return to the other world, follows Gohan's key to the location. When Gohan and Goku test the sharpness of the Z-Sword, the sword breaks, releasing the Elder Kai who had been sealed outside, or inside. The Elder Kai commences a long ceremony to extend Gohan's powers beyond his limits. With that power, Gohan returns to Earth. It's... it's Goku! No, it's not my dad! It's my brother! He's okay! What? That can't be! I'm glad I wasn't too late. Gohan, I'm glad to see you're okay. You weren't dead after all. No, it was a close call. But then the Supreme Kai saved me and took me back to his world. Where's everyone else? Majin Buu ate them. They're all dead. What? <laughs> they were very tasty. Buu turned them all to chocolate. A satisfying snack. <sighs> <laughs> so, Hotshot, you want to fight Majin Buu? <coughs> fight you? No, I want to kill you. Joe, what's up? Welcome in. Not to be controversial at all, but gaming? We are fucking gaming. Oh, well, well. We play Panacorn in like 20 minutes. You're the one down. I blasted to the he next the continent. He didn't say the OG. He didn't say the OG line. Over here. What was the OG line? Dumbass. Call him a dumbass. I'm getting beat. Shoot. You can't win. I'll give you a fight. I miss. I'm fucking lame. Disrupting my flow, you bitch. Win. I'll give you a fight. Okay, we got him this time. <laughs> he calls What? Dragon Ball has gone woke. He calls him the R word. Actually, just the most out of pocket thing they wrote onto the show. Wait, are you joking? Wait, is that real? I'm not. Do you have a clip? I would like to see the OG line. <laughs> it's real? What the fuck? You can't win. I miss. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I'm getting my ass beat. I might lose this fight, TBH. need to do that like three more times into the line you were far too i'll 
give you a fight. Hell yeah, Japan did not give two fucks. Wait, you have it. Hi, Neil. What's up, dude? How are you? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Hold on, I'll watch the clip right now. You can't win. Bitch. Hold on, my cat is here. Uh, while my cat is here, I'm gonna pull this up really quick and watch this. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> hey, behind you. <sighs> Hi, nice day. Nice day. Oh, the dub changed it? After having his way with the citizens of Earth. <laughs> boo, not boo boo. Fool! Kill you all! <sighs> Did you hear that? Uh, yeah. I wish he wouldn't have said that. <gasps> Be careful, boys. He looks like he's about to... <laughs> <laughs> what an insane thing to include. No, Steven, so, like, apparently he didn't say it in this version, but he calls him the R-word, which is fucking insane. Which is, like, why? Why was that dubbed in? The fuck did I just watch? Yeah, so that's what that was. So the dub changed it though, thank God. But like, the subbed early classic two thousands late nineties moment, it was, it was a time. It was a time that we all lived in. Unfortunately, slurring Gohan is peak Gohan. <laughs> what did he say in this version? Does anyone remember what he says? Fuck you. I'm gonna miss my- I'm gonna miss my thing. You can't. I'll give you a fight. Fight you? Oh no, I'm gonna kill you. Oh, that's what he said in the dub, right? He just says I'm gonna kill you. Okay. Doesn't have the same sauce as calling someone the R word. It's it's like it's like calling someone ugly and like adding ugly to anything after is like really funny. It's just like shut the fuck up, ugly, and it just like adds a little bit of sauce that like didn't need to be there, and it's so peak. It's like calling someone ugly over Twitter is like one of the best fucking things. Also, what game are you trying to play, Neil? Gohan manages to push Majin Buu to the brink, but Majin Buu makes himself explode and disappears. Then, after Gohan and the others had searched for an hour, Majin Buu surprises everyone by reappearing on his own. Fusion ha! Here comes the hero of justice! For some reason, Majin Buu begins to taunt Goten and Trunks. The two then fuse and transform into Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. But at that moment, both Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks and the distracted Piccolo are absorbed by Majin Buu. Be honest, Gohan, what do you think? I'd say my strategy was quite successful. You should feel privileged to witness the birth of the ultimate Majin. 
You've got no honor at all. You snuck up on them so they couldn't even fight back. It's your own fault, kid. I'm supposed to be the absolute strongest fighter in the universe. That's when I got the idea. If I could absorb that curious little fuse child, then the boost of my strength would make me completely untouchable. Well, it doesn't seem like this great plan's made you any smarter. A wise fighter wouldn't be telling all this to his enemy. And if you really wanted to become invincible, then you should have used your cowardly little sneak attack to absorb me instead. <laughs> you really don't get it, do you? What? It's just like the previous Majin Buu said. I'm going to kill you in battle no matter what it takes. Nothing less will satisfy me. Okay then. You want to fight? Then let's go. Let's. Though I can sense the time limit on Gotik's power is even shorter than before. So I'll have to make this quick. That's some pretty solid reasoning for a guy like you. I guess Piccolo's intelligence is starting to rub off on you after all. I'll give you a fight. Words with the tear of the cat, and you just get a bullet with enough anger behind it. It's really funny. Dorito, what's up, dog? How are you? I'm just about to wrap up this story, and then we'll uh, get a lobby going. Are you guys ready? You guys ready to game? I'll give you a fight. My cats are fighting. They don't like each other. Well, the other one likes her. Fluffles does not like him. Fluffles is a hateful being. Bubbles is like really sweet to me, but like hates uh, anything else. She's like a tsundere cat. It's really weird. You can't win. It's no good. I'll give you a fight. I miss. I'm sad. No, I'm so sad. I miss. I'm gonna lose! I'm gonna lose! I'm gonna lose! End of the line. I'll put you out of your misery. Take this! No, do I die? I fucking die? Oh no! Bro is giving you work. Majin Buu went the full kitchen aid on you there. Dude, the fucking mix up was crazy. Let me try. Hold on. That was insane. Cannon event? Let's. Though I can sense the time limit on Gotik's power is even shorter than before. So I'll have to make this quick. That's some pretty solid reasoning for a guy like you. I guess Piccolo's intelligence is starting to rub off on you after all. Vivi's got to learn a block. I don't think I know what the block button is on this. This last one should kill. You can't win. I'll give you a fight. We fucking hit each other at the same time. Go 
all out. Hit him with a mix up. You can't go so fast. Shoot. I'll give you a fight. Okay, do I kill? I miss? Wait, why does he have more health? Did when, what? What the fuck? You can't win. Wait, I don't understand. Why does he have more health? Where the fuck'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I'll give you a fight. How do I miss that? He was right in front of me. What? Dude, I'm gonna die. End of the line. It's no joke. You yeah. fell for it. Yeah. I'll give you a fight. I just can't get hit again. If I get hit, I die. You can't win. I'll give you a fight. Do I kill? 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 No, he still has like half a bar left. Fuck me. We're even. We're even. We're sick. I'm fucking sick. Why can't I hit him? Why can't I fucking hit him? Why can't I hit him? Why can't... Why'd it get stuck? I couldn't press B. I don't understand why it wouldn't let me. I don't understand why it wouldn't let me. What the fuck, dude? Let's. Though I can sense the time limit on Gotik's power is even shorter than before. So I'll have to make this quick. That's some pretty solid reasoning for a guy like you. I guess. Piccolo's intelligence is starting to rub off on you after all. Did he just say this will be canon? What did he say there? He said special beam cannon. I really I'll thought he fight. said this will be canon. And I'm like, what? Is he talking in third person? I want to kill myself here. End of the line. I'll give you a fight. Okay, I hurt. Okay. I have to do that a few more times. Why is his health regenerating? Into the line. No. I'll give you a fight. Cause he's Majin Buu, that's his thing. Oh, so I just have to beat him fast. And his health is just regenerating, I'm pissed. You can't win. No more. I'll give you a fight. No, he dodged it. You're such a bitch, dude. I'll put you out of your misery. Take this. Oh no, I die. I die from that. God damn it, dude.
chat, I might not be able to play Pain of Court in time. Give me, give me a sec. I might extend it to like 8:15. Give me like 15 minutes. Time on Gotik's power is even shorter than before, so I'll have to make this quick. That's some pretty solid reasoning for a guy like you. I miss. I'm sad. Yes, Piccolo's intelligence is starting to rub off on you after all. Into the line. I'll give you a fight. Okay. Why can't I? Okay. Into the line. I'll give you a fight. Why am I not? Why is it not generating? There it goes. You can. I'll put you out of your misery. No, please don't. Please don't. Missed. Wait, what? Wait, what? Did I walk into that? What the fuck? I'll give you a fight. I miss. I'm so sad. I'm so fucking sad. I get on here. Weak links will always be weak. Oh, fuck you, I died. Dude. What the fuck, dude? I got really close one time, and then ever since then, I can't do it anymore. Less, though I, can sense the I don't understand. I genuinely don't understand. Before, so I also I'll don't know the block button, so if you guys know what the block button is on the Switch, let me know. For a guy like you. I guess... I don't want to spawn next to him, to please, for the love of God, all. stop doing that. You can't win. I'll give you a fight. How does he dodge that? You can't win. <laughs> I'll put you out of your misery. I'm gonna die here. Get fucked. Oh my god. I'll give you a fight. Oh, and he dodges it? Of course he fucking does. Of course he fucking does. And then he's gonna tether me out of my fucking thing. Yup. 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 You can't win. And then here I try and then I'm gonna hit this again. What? What the fuck? I'm sick. I'm fucking sick, dude. Again, give me like 15 minutes, chat. I will get this down. Let's. Though I can sense the time limit on Gotik's power is even shorter than before. So I'll have to make this quick. That's some pretty solid reasoning for a guy like you. I guess Piccolo's intelligence is starting to rub off on you after all. You can put a pole and see if I can beat it. Not a pole, whatever it is called. I'll give you a fight. Into the line. I'll give you a fight. Into the line. I'll 
give you a fight. I missed. I'm fucking lame. Regenerated so much already. I'm so sad. I basically had to hit him again. Two, three more times, maybe. Same, same attack. Has to hit him. You can't win. I'll give you a fight. Hit him one more time, I think. End of the line. I'll give you a fight. Please don't waste the guy. Okay, do I kill? Is the question. Do I kill? Oh my god, he has a sliver of fucking hell. End of the line. All out. I miss. I'll give you a fight. I miss. Fuck me, dude. Killed his ass. Killed his ass. Absolutely demolished his ass. Fucking game. I don't even think there was a pro uh, a poll. <laughs> you said chat vote and win points. There, I don't think that there was even anything, Tyler. Gohan is struggling in battle when Goku appears in front of receiving life form of the Elder Kai. With him, he carries Patara that would allow him to fuse. However, Gohan fails to catch the Patara that him and his father throws to him. Taking advantage of Go uh, Gohan's distractions, Majin Buu absorbs him. Someone voted for you after you won. <laughs> I guess there is, a, there is a poll. I didn't see it on my end. Vegeta then returns to the other worlds only for a day to fuse with Goku and become the strongest warrior ever known, Vegito. Despite having absorbed Gohan, Buu is easily overpowered by Vegito. There it is. Uh, but in order to save his friends, Fuse Saiyan allows himself to be consumed by Buu. Thanks to Goku and Vegeta, Goku and Gohan and victims of Majin Buu have been saved. As a result, Majin Buu transforms and lets loose a massive key wave and Gohan and the others aren't able to make time for instant transmission leaving them to be annihilated along with the entire Earth. However, thanks to the Team Heroics, Earth and all the people who have been wiped off the map are brought back in their place. Do I finish? Hell yeah! We did it! Fucking cleared! Alright, are you guys ready to game? Uh, I will meet you guys on Discord, if you guys are there. Hold on. I will be in the... Gaming lobby chat. I will be in here if you guys want to tap in. I think this is Jester, uh, Joe, uh, Dorito, forgot who else, Steven. Uh, yeah, but if I if I said your name, feel free to jump into VC, and we will we will game soon. This is gonna be you. My lawyer will get me out. Thank you. Also, 12k points to ya, yeah, of course, is insane. Alright. We did it, chat. You fucking did it. Let me go back and see what the what ifs. Do I get a different scenario for anything else out here? I feel like I haven't seen a what if in a bit. No, 
Nar. Nar, I don't see it. All right, we will continue Gohan's story later. We will resume Sparking Zero later. For now, I'm going to change the game to uh there we go boom switched it up on you guys we're playing panicord tonight and then okay oh hell yeah everyone's in here god it's gone and it turned back around dude i i remember being in the stairwell and i was like how the fuck did three people just consecutively die wait what happened we're talking about 